In this video, I'm going to explain the basic networking commands of Linux operating system. The first and most important network configuration command is interface configuration or as an abbreviation, we write it as ifconfig. You can run the ifconfig command as a normal user to view the configuration of your network cards. Right now in my computer, there are two network cards shown in this output. The first network card is shown as ENP0S3. The colon is not the part of the name. The second one is LO, loopback adopter. So in my computer, I have two network cards, ENP0S3. This is my physical Ethernet or network card. LO is a loopback adopter used for testing purpose. For example, if I install SSH on my computer, and I want to test it locally, so I will use this IP address to connect locally. With INET, it is showing the IP version 4, the IP address of this machine assigned to this network card. The net mask at here is 255, 3 times, and then 0. In some operating systems such as Windows, it is also known as a subnet mask. Subnet mask or net mask is the same thing inet6 is the IP version 6 address whereas the ether is your physical address or a MAC address if I wanted to display only the IP address of my physical network card so I can write down here if config ENP 0s3 this will show me only the configuration of physical network card which is ENP 0s3 in some computers or some Linux distribution it is referred as ETH 0 ping command uses the IP address or a domain name I can write down here ping yahoo.com I can also try pinging to my Windows I machine, which is ping 110.0.2.2. Now, before I use the domain name, now I'm using the IP address. To stop this, I have to press Ctrl C. If I wanted to use the ping command for a specific number of times or specific count, such as I want to ping three times, the IP address so I'll say ping my IP address let's say 127.0.0.1 and then minus C for counting 3 so it will ping 3 times and it will stop automatically another option for ping command is minus I I stand for interval if I wanted to send it with the interval of 2 seconds I press I, I will use minus I2 so right now it's waiting for two seconds before sending the next packet. The last option that I'm going to demonstrate is minus S. S stand for size. I can specify the size as 20,000. So a 20,000 bytes will be sent. I can also send the same thing to any other IP address. Ping 10.0.2.2 minus s 2000 minus c five times so it will send 2000 bytes packet five times to the ip address 10.0.2.2 the if command can also be used to change or modify the ip address of any network card you can change the ip address of any of your network cards right now in my machine i have two network cards enp 0 s3 and loopback adopter which is lo but to make any modification i have to be root so i can become root by typing su i'm switching to root user you can see right now i'm logged in as root so as a root i can modify the ip address if i type the command if config E N P zero S three. I'm seeing the IP address is ten fifteen to ten dot zero dot two dot fifteen. 
I can modify it to 192.168.5.5. So if I check again, you can see the new IP address is applied. If you also want to make the subnetting or you want to make modify the subnet mask, you can also append the subnet mask with the same IP address by writing here net mask and I can specify 255.255.248 .255 or 255.22 or 128. So this time if I'm checking the IP address, the net mask is also modified. You can modify the IP address or you can modify the subnet mask or you can modify both of them for any particular network card. I also have a loopback adapter. Although it is not recommended, but you can also test. You can also modify the IP address of the loopback adapter by saying let's say 10.0.0 dot dot five so if i check the ip address of loop packet operates also modified but it is not recommended thank you for watching the simple tutorial for the basic networking command in linux